Wrestling Championships at 103 pounds. In Class A, it'll be Brad Metzler, 31-0, undefeated freshman from Omaha Westside, beating Joss Buckles, a 26-6 junior from Omaha Central. Then Class B, it's Casey Cole, the freshman from Omaha Scott, meeting Mike Reifenrath, a senior, 25 and 4 from Seward. In Class C, it'll be Andy Sire, 33 and 3 sophomore from Neely Oakdale, meeting Heath Meekum or Heath McKim, excuse me, 32 and 0, a freshman from Valley. And in Class D, Jeremy Polson, 33 and 4, a sophomore from Elgin Petersburg, meeting Kyle Stover, an undefeated 25 and 0 sophomore from Amherst. And again, uh, you'll get to see all four matches as they go along. We'll be hearing occasionally from uh, R.J. Neeby, my partner this afternoon, who is an assistant coach uh, at Omaha Scott. We'll have a microphone on him and uh, occasionally hear on that uh, matchup between Casey Cole and Mike Reifenrath. There should be a very good matchup between those two. So we'll hear from him occasionally, and we'll certainly keep you up to date on the other matches as well. Again, as you look on your screen, you'll see all four matches, A and B on top. C and D, the two on the bottom, will try to keep you updated on the scores as we go along through all 14 weight classes. Glad to have you along this afternoon, and let's get ready to wrestle. Again in uh, Class A, Brad Metzler, undefeated, a freshman. This is always exciting when you see a freshman have the opportunity, and of course, those of us that follow the state tournament year in and year out always hope to see a four-time uh, champion and I've never seen a four-time undefeated champion of course we had the two Nord Hughes brothers from Greeley uh, not too long ago in fact uh, two years ago finished their careers as four-time champions but uh, Kenny Nord Hughes did have one lone defeat so we've come close but one of these days it'll happen maybe it'll be Brad Metzler from Omaha West Side an undefeated freshman also again in class B we have Casey Cole 32 and one another freshman Mike Reifenrath, the 25 and 4 senior, who had to come from behind in both his quarterfinal matches. And uh, in C, at Andy Sire from Neely Oakdale facing Keith McKim from Valley. And in D, Jeremy Polson of Elgin Petersburg squaring up against Kyle Stover, a sophomore. And the four matches are underway here at the Bob DeFanny Sports Center, another sold out championship afternoon. All four wrestlers right now kind of feeling their way through. In uh, Class B, Mike Reifenrath that I spoke of uh, upended the number one ranked wrestler Kelly Vice of Valentine in the semifinals, 15 to 14. What a match that was. He came from behind to win that. In fact, in his uh, quarterfinal match, he won 9 to 6. He did get uh, through 17 to 2 in the technical uh, with the technical fall in the opening round. Again, action taking place in all four matches as. Uh, we have a stoppage right now in Class B. It looks like no scoring so far in the other three matches. We did have two points scored for Josh Buck, or uh, excuse me, for uh, Casey Cole of Omaha Gross, or Omaha Scott in Class B. Casey Cole has the first two points, and he leads it two to nothing. Again, no, uh, we do have two points now scored in Class D. Two points scored for Jeremy Polson. Elgin Petersburg, he now leads it two to nothing over Kyle Stover. Again, Polson, 33 and four, a sophomore. Stover's unbeaten, 25 and 0. He is also a sophomore. Stover from Amherst. Again, Polson has jumped out two to nothing with the lead there. Now we have a score in Class C. A takedown is uh, scored. In that one by Heath McKim, the undefeated freshman from Valley. So McKim leading two to nothing in Class C. An escape just occurred in Class D. And it's now a 2-1 lead for Jeremy Polson, who's on the verge. Nope, that is. As we take a look, trying to look at the, we have the ankle bracelets that help identify the wrestlers. And sometimes it's a little hard to see. And it does uh, look as though now Stover has gotten the takedown. And Stover now jumps out to a 3-2 lead on Jeremy Polson in Class D. In Class B, we're still 2-0. Casey Cole leading Reifenrath of Seward. And in Class A, we now have a 2-0 lead with Brad Metzler of Omaha Westside, then defeated freshman with a 2-0 lead. So now we have scoring in each match. They're still in the first periods. Again, in Class D, it's a 3-2 lead for Kyle Stover of Amherst over Jeremy Polson of Elgin Petersburg. Over in Class B, 
Casey Cole with the 2-0 lead. Cole of Omaha Scott leading Mike Reifenrath of Seward. In Class A, Metzler of Westside still with the 2-0 lead over Josh Buckles of Central. And in Class C, Heath McKim, the 2-0 lead over Andy Sire of Neely Oakdale. So that's your scoring so far. And now we're tied up in Class D. That match is really shaping up to be a great one between Polson and Stover as it's tied up at 3-3. And still uh, with the best of it on top is Jeremy Polson, Belgian Petersburg. Fighting Stover very hard. Uh, Polson did medal last year. He got fifth at 103 pounds. Stover did not place as a freshman. We still are taking the uh, look at all the scores here in Class B. Again, it's still two to nothing. Casey Cole with that lead over Mike Reifenrath of Seward in Class A. And Brad Metzler continues to lead two nothing over Josh Buckles, and in Class C, it's now a two-one lead for Heath McKim. And uh, in Class C, some uh, pretty good action right now with Heath McKim, the 32-0 freshman from Valley, who got to the finals with a 10-6 victory in the first round, 4-3 decision in the second round. He won 4-2 in overtime of the semifinals. So McKim had a tough semifinal match, but right now in control 4-1 over Andy Sire of Neely Oakdale, who won by pin in his opening round, won by decisions of 9-2 and 5-3 to get to the championship match. So Sire facing McKim again in Class C, and uh, now we have an escape. Let's check now in Class B. Again, it's uh, Omaha Scott's Casey Cole leading in that match. By score, five to nothing over Mike Reifenrath of Seward. And again, R.J. Neeby is uh, my partner this afternoon uh, and assistant coach at no, Omaha no, no, Scott. The head coach, Brad Hildebrandt. And if we get a chance, we'll listen in to R.J. to a little bit of that match and kind of get a coach's perspective. In Class A, it's still a 2-0 lead for Brad Metzler of Omaha Westside over Josh Buckles of Omaha Central. And we're tied at Class D yet at 3-3 in the second period, but we have uh, still have both wrestlers in that position as we did have an escape. An escape is scored by Kyle Stover of Amherst, and Stover now leads it 4-3. Both wrestlers, and now uh, two points have been awarded to Jeremy Polson of Elgin Petersburg. So Polson takes back the lead 5-4. What a great battle that has been. It appears Polson has been the better wrestler on his feet and has gotten the takedowns, but then Stover able to get escapes or reversals. And so it's a 5-4 lead for Polson and Elgin Petersburg, but we do have stoppage in that match. In Class C, Heath McKim of Valley continues to lead 4-2 over Andy Sire of Neely Oakdale. And in Class A, it's now a 3-0 lead for Brad Metzler of Omaha Westside over Josh Buckles of Omaha Central. So a lot of action uh, taking place on the match, and it does appear as Casey Cole continues to uh, have it in cruise control over in Class B. And I think Cole is trying to get the pin. Casey Cole trying to go for the pin, but now uh, Rife and Rath able to escape. But Cole will pick up three more points and take an 13 to nothing lead. Two more points, and he'll win by technical fall. But now escape scored by Rife and Rath. Meanwhile, in Class D, Jeremy Polson has scored again with a takedown and leads it 7-5, to five, but then lets Stover loose so he can try to take him down again because Polson has been very, very good on his feet and leads it 7-5 to five in Class D. In Class C, it's a 6-3 lead for Heath McKim of Valley over Andy Sire of Neely Oakdale. And in Class A, 3 to nothing, Brad Metzler leading Josh Buckles. It's a 13-1 lead now for Casey Cole of Omaha Scott over Mike Reifenrath of Seward. Reifenrath placed fifth last year. Cole being a freshman, of course, his first trip down here. Let's take a look now in Class C. Both wrestlers up. It's a 6-3 lead for Heath McKimba Valley leading Andy Sire of Neely Oakdale. As McKim undefeated as a freshman, would love to... Cap off an unbeaten season at the state championship. 
And now in Class D, we're getting close to a pin. On top is Jeremy Polson of Elgin Petersburg and gets the pin. So Jeremy Polson, who had a seesaw battle going there, comes up with the victory for Elgin Petersburg. And Polson finishes the season as a sophomore at 34 and 4. Polson winning over Kyle Stover, who was unbeaten coming into the match as sophomore. So Stover losing his first match of the year. That's a tough way to do it. And now it looks like we're going to have victory for Omaha Skett, their first state champion, Casey Cole, the freshman, will finish at 33 and 1, as I believe he ended up winning by technical fall. We have someone standing right in front of the score of, uh, podium where we cannot see the score for sure. I believe it was 15 or 16 1, but we'll have to get that officially. But he won by technical fall. And now we're having some other champions crowned here as we'll try to get those for you. 8 to 4 in Class C. It's McKim winning over Andy Sire. And in Class A, the victory is going to Brad Metzler, who finishes undefeated as a freshman as he wins it 7 to 2. So we have our four champions crowned very quickly. Boy, that happened in a hurry. We'll be glad to get R.J. Neeby back over here to help us out the rest of the way through. And I know R.J. is going to be really happy as his wrestler won. And again, we'll try to get that uh, final for you here in a little bit. So 103-pound class is over with. We have 13 more to go. And we'll have all the action for you along with the medal ceremonies as we go along this afternoon. Again, I'm Steve Roth. I want to uh, thank the Nebraska High School Wrestling Coaches Association for all their help and getting ratings and so forth and helping us out with a lot of information. Let's take a look now at the 103-pound weight class in Class A. Again, Brad Metzler, the champion of Omaha Westside, winning over Josh Buckles of Omaha Central, 7-2. Metzler finishes out his freshman season at 32-0. In Class B, it's Casey Cole winning 17 to 1 by technical fall over Mike Reifenrath of Seward. In Class C, Andy or uh, Heath McKim finishes unbeaten as a freshman with an 8-4 win over Andy Sire of Neely Oakdale. And in Class D, Jeremy Polson gets the first pin of the tournament in the championship match, beating Kyle Stover of Amherst. So Polson finishes at 34 and 4. And they're your champions at Class 103 pounds.